My motto is, Jesus said in his word that he came to serve and not to be served. God doesn't have any hands and feet. That's our job, to serve one another. It's my passion, it's my calling, it's what I do, and I wouldn't change it for the world. My Anita. My esteemed colleague and friend. My spiritual carrier. Thank you for being my buddy. When you walked in the door to apply for a caregiving position, my gut told me you were special. In the winter of 2016, I got a call from a Milwaukee police officer about a wanderer they had picked up. His name was Ed. He desperately needed care. You stepped in, grabbed your walking shoes, and began to work your magic. You and Ed were such a match made in heaven. With our playing cards, or your weekly trips to the thrift store in search of the ugliest shirt, you always turn the mundane into something fun. You were my voice when I needed you. Thank you for helping me on my spiritual journey, for helping me do something. That was very important to me. Anita, you are a special person. You can talk to anyone, and boy, do you do to everyone, but don't ever change. You and I have shared so many stories with each other. You're such a hard worker with a wonderful outlook on life. You brought my attitude down and it's helping me to become a better person. Congratulations on your award. You are being acknowledged by a group of people that I'm very fond of. We have this other award in Miami. Be open and ask, use your voice to show them who you are. Don't stay in Miami, remember to come back home. Thank you, Anita. Respectfully, Rick. Keep smiling, Paul. Love, darling.